Hey everyone, I'm a Fire Modeler at Ferrari and today I will show you how to create and edit implementation guides in Simplifier. So here we are at the home screen. To create a new IG, we go to our little avatar top right and we go to Portal. The portal will list all the projects that we have here. So we'll scroll down to a sample project I've created for this. And this is our project homepage. On the project homepage, we have a tab for the guides. These are your implementation guides. And we can hit the little create link here to create a new guide. Call it, for example, uh, my sample IG. Hit the create button. And now we can hit the edit button right here. This is the implementation guide editor. There are four important panes that you need to know about. The pane on the left is the navigation pane. We can create new, uh, new pages by clicking the little new button here. And we call our new page, page 2, for the uh, very creative among us. In the middle, we have the implementation guide editor. This is where we can write our text. So if I add in some sample text here, and I click the little refresh button on the far right, this pane will refresh. So if you've guessed it, far left is the navigation pane, middle is where you edit your content of an individual page, and far right is your preview pane, where you can see how your content looks like. And the last pane, the fourth pane, is the help menu. Opening, of us, opening up this up here will allow you to see all sorts of hints on how you can edit your implementation guide. Now that we've created a skeleton IG, we can hit the preview page here to see how it would look like if we decided to share this with somebody else. This is the style it has right now. There is a table of contents on the far left and these are the two pages that we have. We can change the style of our implementation guide by going to the little settings knob over to the style tab and selecting the two level menu as the different as the other style. Selecting that and then refreshing our implementation guide will show a more HL7 look with the navigation menu available on the top. Now this is pretty bare bones right now and we don't have any resources showing inside it. To show a resource we can go to the rendering fire help menu and we see that we can do command colon project name slash resource name to do something with that resource. So for example if we want to show a structure definition table that is a profile actually let's make a tree instead that looks better we can do tree slash dav slash patient. Now, returning back to the sample project we've created, we have a profile available here already, an L core location, and I'd like to put this into my implementation guide. So to do that, we can copy the tree tag we can go to a page where we want to enter it, paste it in here, and then we copy this part of the URL that is a project and the resource, and we enter it after a colon, just like that. We hit the refresh button, and here is our, our resource, our profile, rendered all in line. Now this is one way of looking at it. The other way, besides tree, is to use the render tag. That will show a slightly different view, which is um, more space efficient. Clicking on the preview tab again, we we'll go to page two, and we see that our IG instantly refreshed. It shows our resource here, and now we can copy this link here. Copy it and we can share it with our coworkers or anybody else who would like to see it and this is it that's all you need to know